Oops, mo the Mossville community, okay. this little community. Mm -hmm. This was one of the British planters that came here uh, somewhere in the 1800s. Uh, and on his death, he freed his slaves. About the same time, the United States started the Homestead Exemption, or the Homestead Act. Mm -hmm. And that was where any, any citizen could claim 160 acres. I mean, and, but they had to live on it and improve it for five years, sometimes three years, and then it became theirs. And that's how the community of Mossville was built, okay. through the Homestead Exemption Act because other, you know, then they could do another plot and you know, another plot. Uh, and the, the community was originally called Shope's Prairie because there were tons of wild pigs everywhere. So at least meat was plentiful. They could, <laughs> they could, they could grow vegetables. What and, became of those pigs now? Huh? What became of the pigs? Uh, well, I don't know. I, they you killed all of them? They must have because I haven't seen any wild pigs over there. Oh. Um, so they, uh, as, as the planters began to die or whatever, they would free the, their slaves and then that, that's how the community of Mossville. Uh, well, most not. of these men were from England, they mm -hmm. came. And so, yes, you know, they, they uh, they, they freed them and they went on to farm this community. Mm. And then the most important things in, in the community were the, the school and the church. And uh, it was it stopped being a school in 91, it became the special services, you know, that get them back to Jesus. Thank you.